This is Justin Germino from DragonBlogger.com. I'm here to talk to you about adding your blog or website behind the Encapsula Security and Content Delivery Network. Encapsula is a cloud hosting solution that sits in front of your website. It intercepts all traffic to your blog or website. What it does is it screens out and blocks bad bots, hack attempts, and other illegal resources from being accessed, as well as providing a caching option so that resources are served from the cloud instead of causing extra strain against your hosting provider resources. It's easy to get started. Just sign up for Encapsula.com and then go to the Add a Website option. Enter the name of the website you want to add. In this case, I'm adding btowners.com and click on Add Website. Now Encapsula will scan your website to collect the information that it needs to set up on its side, such as the IP address, where it's located, which hosting provider, uh, whether it's HTTP or HTTPS, and then it will configure some options on its side. Click on Continue when this is done. And here you'll have instructions to update your zones, your DNS zones, in your web hosting provider so that the DNS redirects to Encapsula for your website. This is pretty easy to do if you have a hosting provider that uses cPanel, which is really easy to just edit your zones. I use Bluehost, but the instructions are the same for any hosting provider that uses cPanel. What you want to do is scroll down to where you find your DNS zone editor. Here you want to select the DNS name for the site you want to make changes to. And then you're going to want to add the A name records first that Encapsula recommends. My first entry here will be for btowners.com and point to the first Encapsula IP address and click Add Record. Repeat the second A name record. Copy the IP address. Type btowners.com second IP address gets posted. Click on Add Record. Then what you want to do is you want to go back and remove your original record which still points to your original hosting provider IP. Make sure you delete that record so that the only records that show under the A name with the at symbol are the two Encapsula IPs. Double check them. 199831345 and 199831332233. Okay, those are correct. So next we move on to the CNAME record. Again, this will be the DNS name of the Encapsula cloud. Make sure you copy it and go into your CNAME record part. Just click on edit and change where the www record points to, to the Encapsula environment. Click on save. And then your changes are complete. Go over to Encapsula and say you completed the DNS changes after you finish those changes. And then you just have to wait until the DNS propagation occurs, which can take up to two hours. You may get a warning about FTP. FTP doesn't work through the Encapsula cloud. So if you still need to use FTP access to your blog, you will have to update your FTP record in your zone editor to still point to the IP address of your hosting provider so that FTP does not try to go through the Encapsula cloud. Something to note, if you use a shared hosting provider, you can't use a specific IP address for FTP since it's a shared hosting. This only works if you have a dedicated IP address. In anywhere from 15 minutes to about a half an hour, you'll see when you refresh Encapsular, your website no longer says pending and shows that it's enabled. Here it'll start collecting traffic, but it will take about a day before you start seeing any noticeable traffic in a graph. You could see from some of my other sites that they've been up and collecting traffic for a while. You could always click on stats where you show traffic coming in in real time, uh, any security events that are recorded, the performance, and the activity log. Encapsula will protect your website and it will help reduce the amount of load on your web servers. It will block all those bots, a lot of comment spammers, as well as any hack attempts against your WordPress blog. I'll just show you a quick example of what DragonBlogger.com looks like behind Encapsula. This is the traffic and the various security events that have occurred. You can see it's blocked uh, 2,709 comment spammers, 12 spam bot visits, uh, various scanners. So if you're looking to get a little more performance out of your shared hosting platform or your blog in general, or you want to increase the security for your blog, I recommend you put it behind the Encapsula cloud service. 
This works very well at keeping your blog more secure, reducing the load on your web hosting, and gives you a little more for your blog. It is free for blogs that have 50 gigabytes or less of data transfer per month. If your blog or your site generates more than 50 gigabytes of data per month transfer to visitors, then you'll need a paid platform or one of the subscription programs. But I highly recommend the service, whether or not you use the free service or whether or not you use the premium service and the plan. It's worth the monthly payment to keep your blog secure, to reduce the load on your hosting, and to get the metrics and the statistics on what's going on with the activity to your blog. Thank you for watching.